Yo guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can make your Mac faster or even say overclock it. To do that, uh, you want to download this uh, turbo switcher from this website. I'll also link it down in the description. Uh, you do not need the turbo switcher pro because it doesn't have any functions that you need and you can get that with other uh, programs for free. So uh, to get this program, you want to download the turbo switcher from this website that, as I already said and you just want to get it now for free. Uh, you'll get a zip file um, under downloads and you want to unzip it and once you've unzipped you get this folder with uh, readme and to uh, boost switcher. Um, you read this if you want to but just double click on to boost the switch. Um, as you open it no app is going to open but up here in the taskbar you see this lightning bolt and it says to boost switcher. Uh, under this folder, you can see like the CPU load, the temperature of the CPU, and uh, the fan speed. Because uh, it's, this is Apple, it's uh, the fan speed only goes like on when it's like at seventy five degrees, pretty much. And um, yeah, so it's automatically activated when the program is open. So your CPU has, uh, or all Intel CPUs have like hyper threading. That means that uh, some cores can go over their core clock and um, then for it be faster. And uh, this only happens when uh, your um, PC is like under a load. So you're like uh, rendering a video or something like that. And then it turns on like some cores, the uh, hyper threading. And um, yeah, so as I said, it only turns on when it's under load. But if you just want the performance just on your like all day basis, um, you just, can turn it on with this program and you have the hyper threading on all, all the time there's like only one small catch um if you're like on a uh imac or a mac pro so on things that are connected with power uh with a, a cord you just don't have to worry about anything because uh you don't you notice the power difference um but if you're like on a um uh, I'm MacBook um, or a MacBook Pro or something. Um, the problem could be that your battery runs out faster, and um, that's why if you just say, "Okay, I don't need it right now," I will just go up here and uh, just uh, end it right here, or just end the whole program. I just like to end the program because it seems like to me it's like really deactivated. So you press that, and it's away. And you want to turn it back on? You just double click on the program again, and um, yeah. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this short video on how to overclock your um, Mac or uh, turn on the hyper threading. And, yeah, I hope that I could help you out with this video. And, yeah, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.